So I've just released um, my new album, it's called Here and Now, it's got nine original compositions on it and uh, it's been released um, on Pathway Records which is a record label which is run by saxophonist Paul Booth um, which features <coughs> mostly jazz and world music um, so it's great to be involved with that um, and the project was supported by QR funding as well uh, which gave me time to um, write the album, record it and it's following through on some research that I've been doing looking at muscle memory and improvisation particularly on the guitar and a kind of relationship between those two things and so what I wanted to do was explore that research a bit more in some of my own music um, write some of my own music and then do some analysis of my own playing which I've never done before so I've analysed other players um, through kind of DVD live footage of them playing but I've never really looked at the way I improvise myself in that sense and that kind of relationship between technique and improvisation anyway so yeah so this project gave me a chance to write some new music, record it, play with some great musicians um, and to then kind of look at a kind of look at developing a model of analysis through looking at footage of that process, of the recording process and of the performance of playing it live. So the album was recorded over two days in this studio here um, in March and then um, we spent a good time mixing it after that but the, the main recording was all done live by the band and uh, some great musicians on that so we've got Andrew Bain on drums, Dave Whitford on bass, Steve Hamilton on piano and Paul Booth on saxophone as well and Simon Foster also features on one track on vocals as well and uh, yeah it was all recorded live over two days and it was engineered recorded by Sam Hughes who was fantastic and Sam um, also spent a lot of time with me sort of mixing it afterwards and um, Panos mastered it so a good kind of team effort <laughs> enough to uh, perform the album live so the album was launched in the Canterbury Festival um, and performed the full album in Ansome Studios um, which was uh, great that went really well it obviously was video and um, that's going to be helpful in terms of doing some kind of comparative analysis of the studio takes and also the takes live and um, so the plan is to use the footage that we took from the studio and the live footage and compare what I'm doing you know in the improvised sections um, differently to see that you I know, kind of look for kind of things I'm common themes common ideas that run through the way that I approach improvisation <laughs> lucky to have played with such a good band, you know, such a good group of players. Um, the performances on the album from, from them are all you know great, outstanding performances. So yeah, and I'm and I'm proud of the compositions too, um, and of my own performance on it as well. Mm -hmm. 